So we're back at Little Sugar. We're hitting the Down Under Trail. We're going in it backwards from last time. Gonna see how it goes. been a little wet and cool out here the last week or so so we figured the little sugar trails are generally safe to ride in the wet you won't destroy them because they're pretty rocky yeah, going down this is way better than going up it <laughs> this is quite the climb when you run it in the other direction like we did last week, last time we were here. Also nice coming down this with a uh, tire full of air instead of a flat. Well, I just had to say something about it being a lot more fun without a flat tire. At least luckily this time I brought a spare tube, so... Let's get a tube on it and see what happens. Okay, got a new tube in it. I'm running it super hard, so hopefully... It'll stay there. <laughs> and hopefully with it being aired up as far as I aired it up, I can still have a little bit of traction. So far so good. I always have a difficulty getting these 2.8 tires to see. I don't know if that's just me or if that's just normal 2.8 tires. But that took way too long to get to see. And we're going down hills. Yeah, these berms are sweet. Where I stopped to wait for Cassie, I saw a line that looked really fun. I'm gonna try it out. That's pretty sweet. All right, that was fun. Nice little high speed section. Make sure Cassie gets down okay. We're starting to learn every time there's a road crossing, it means you're about to have some fun. Couldn't figure out which way I needed to look, left, look next. This looks like it could be interesting, but I can't tell. It could just be a bunch of hill climbs. <laughs> huh. A little bit of both. That's pretty cool. 
That reminds me of one of my favorite dirt bike trails going up out in the Texas Panhandle. Oh, nice. Downhill mood engage it again. That's really cool out here. It's a lot more. You go up, you go down, you go up, you go down. It's not like the back 40 where you climb forever and then you go down a little bit, then you climb forever and you go down a little bit. Which I like that for my training ride when I go riding on Tuesdays or something. But for my Sunday ride or just coming out for fun, this is way better. It kind of shows on trail forks. You got a uh, 681 descent, 681 inch, fine. And then you can really tell riding it that it's really balanced. <laughs> All right, fixed on that focus point instead of looking where I needed to look. All right, let's let Cassie catch up here. Yeah, we still got some down to go yet. Oh, well, maybe not. <laughs> Just go around the corner and it's all right back to the climb. So like I said, the balance is so great. You climb a little bit and you go down a while and then you climb a little bit and you go down a while. I think they did a great job with this down under loop. <laughs> I shifted my weight to the front in the middle of that. That was interesting. All right. We just realized we have a lot more downhill to go on this one. This is pretty cool. Just in this area here. Well, I'm in next gear already. <laughs> Big boom, boom. Some of these things are really weird today. But it's fun. Where are we getting some steep here? Well, not really. About to hit the climb though. <laughs> nice, jumped into the berm. That was sweet. Yeah, that was wet. My tire's super, super pumped up. And I didn't slip. The Cassie berm technique. I'm being <laughs> oh, cool. Oh wow, this is going to get steep in a hurry. Ooh, had to get out of the saddle. I was in fourth gear somehow. Kind of impressed with that. 
This poor guy's been waiting here for his riding buddy to make it up that hill climb since the 50s. That section was super cool. Those berms were perfect for my use to ability. Yeah, this is so cool. So we've got to be getting somewhat close to the truck. Not that I'm ready for it to be over, but my GoPro battery's getting low. And I'm hoping it'll hold out for all the cool mountain sections like this. I'm not sure if we have any more after this one or not, but we've got to have something for that. We gotta be getting close to where I flattened my front tire on the left when we were out here. I think we are getting close to where I blew my front tire out last time we were here. Oh, this is cool. Trying not to blow my tires out again. Hey! I don't want to speak too soon, but at least for that section. I think that creek way down there in the bottom would be awesome to work on trials riding. Probably an awesome place to find some snakes too, though. Wow. That's cool. Maybe, I'm not sure. Ooh, a little higher gear. Okay, so that last section with all the rocks was where I pinch flighted my front tire last time and cut my ride short. Now we're back. We're on the final hill climb to get back to where the truck is. And Cassie's not going super great. I think she kind of hit a wall. She's trying to get a migraine, maybe. I'm feeling pretty decent. But considering my general fitness, fitness level anyway, I'll be impressed if I can make this in one go. Hey, it's sprinkling again. Got these little clouds moving overhead. I'll sprinkle and be sunny and sprinkle and then be sunny. Oh man. Oh, that's the last big corner, I think. I had to stop. All right, it's getting way too high. All right, so we finally made it back to the truck. We did the full down under loop. This time the flat didn't keep me from completing it, which is awesome. Uh, I'm glad that I came prepared this time and brought a spare tube. Uh, it's weird, I pinch flatted the back just like I pinch flatted the front last time, but made it back to the truck, did the full five mile loop and I'm pretty pumped about that. It was super fun. I love how it's got the downhills for a, like a sustained little section. Then you've got a pretty good climb and a sustained downhill. Um, it's nice and punchy and it's not like 
climbing forever for a short downhill and it's pretty cool. So I'm super excited that we made the whole thing and uh, yeah, awesome to do that. I uh, got to put a new tube in my camera bag so the next time we go we'll have a spare again. But yeah, I'm pretty pumped on that. So until next time guys, keep it on two wheels.